A bear! I'm taking you on a trip across Canada. We're gonna see the West Coast, the Rocky Mountains, the prairies, the Canadian Shield, and the Great Lakes. We're gonna go all the way over to the East Coast. And I want you to sit right here as we go on an adventure across Canada. A mountain. I'm going up a mountain. Wow, look at this. This is Whistler. I'm going up. I don't know what, what this mountain is called. I think it's called Black Comb Mountain here in Whistler. Wow, look at that. I'm in a gondola. This is called a gondola. I'm going up to the top of a mountain. See those things there? Those are called chair lifts. Okay, where you just sort of sit on the, the chair and it's open air. This is a, a gondola. I wish there was a window so I could hold my camera out the window because these, uh, these glass things are a bit dirty and they're tinted. So you can't actually see the, you know, the real colors. It's probably a little bit dark on the video. But when I get up to the top of the mountain, I'll make a better video for you guys. All right, we're at the top of the mountain. Wow, nice Canadian flags, fresh air. Hey, look at this, the Olympic rings. You know, um, remember the, the Winter Olympics in 2010 in Vancouver? Well, actually, a lot of the events were here in Whistler, right? Because there are no mountains right in Vancouver. The mountains are here in Whistler. So all the skiing events and any event that, that requires a mountain was here in in Whistler. So take a look at this. Hmm, I'm gonna try to find a good lookout point to uh, to take a good picture down there of the of the village of Whistler. All right, I found the perfect spot to take a picture. The observation deck. Check it out. It's a nice bar here overlooking the whole valley. If you remember the Winter Olympics, then you'll remember this logo. This, uh, this sign that was, you know, everywhere in all the commercials and on all the, uh, just on everything. You know how sporting events have a, have like a logo or a mascot or whatever. Well, this was it for the, the Vancouver Olympics. Wow, look at that. Isn't this amazing? Look at those beautiful mountains over there and over there. A bear right beside my car! Should I get out of my car and give him a hug? Oh no, he's walking away. Hey, come back here. Hey, over here. All right, I found a nice quiet spot here in the woods just outside Whistler to eat my lunch. What do we have on the menu today? Want to take a guess? We have steak! Wow, look at that. And look at this. Homemade kefir. You can see it's starting to separate a little bit. Remember uh, a few days ago I taught you how to make kefir. So this is it. Let's taste it. Wow, that's good. That is delicious. Okay, so just enjoying the peace and quiet, although there are quite a few mosquitoes out here, so to be careful that I don't get bitten by mosquitoes. Okay, so maybe we should roll the dice. What do you think about that? Hmm, I'm trying to think about how I can get it to land on like or subscribe. We haven't had a subscribe yet. 
maybe if I put a back spin, if I put a back spin on it, then it might give me some some better luck. Okay, you ready? Here we go. Yes! Subscribe! <laughs> Take a look at that. My strategy worked. Put, putting a back spin. Hmm. I'll remember that for next time. Putting a, a back spin on it. That gives me good luck. All right. I wish you could join me here in the woods for some lunch. Although, there are bears around here. Are you afraid of bears? Just today, I've seen about five, I think four or five bears. And before that, I, in the, a few days ago, I saw a few bears too. So, so overall, on my trip, I think I've seen, I've seen maybe six bears so far on my trip. So, gotta keep an eye out for, for some bears. Anyway, join me for lunch, and then afterwards, I'm gonna take you through the, the village, through, um, through Whistler Village. Just walk around and show you different things, you know, different things to see there. And uh, so, let's fill up first, and then let's go. All right, guys, just got back from lunch. Now I'm gonna show you around Whistler Village a bit. Wow, it's a really nice place. Basically, you'll see three things here. You'll see hotels, which is uh, my hotel is this one right here. It's called Blackcomb Lodge. Okay, so you'll see hotels, you'll see restaurants and bars, and the third thing you'll see is gift shops. So let's see, am I right or am I right? See this sign here, it says Village Center. Okay, so we are entering the village center let's take a look around here a little bit okay we have a nice village square here and okay already you can see some restaurants some bars some gift shops and some hotels ah, look at this nice place it's a really nice atmosphere all right as you can see we've got some shops here what does this say? Inclusivity is true to our nature. Hmm, interesting. Okay, look, you can buy all kinds of Canada stuff in, uh, in these shops, all kinds of souvenirs and other gift things. It's, yeah, you know, it's a really nice place. I, I like places like this, but at the same time, I don't like places like this. I feel a little bit uncomfortable because it's, uh, it's really congested, right? This, uh, a place like this. Right now, it's actually not that busy, but a place like this can get really congested. You know, there are just people everywhere, um, cars, cars driving around. There's nowhere to park. You know, there there is a there are a few free parking spots, but only for 15 minutes. Okay, so you, if you want to buy something, you park, and then you have to leave in 15 minutes. Otherwise, you'll get a ticket. So that's one of the downsides of a place like this. It's really congested. Um, you have to pay for parking. If you want to park for like a day or for a few hours, you have to pay maybe like like 20 bucks or something like that for, for the day. So here it is. I mean, just, just look at this. A lot of hotels, right? Like I said, you've got different hotels. Now, usually hotels in a place, place like this, um, the hotels are called lodges. Lodges, all the hotels are lodges, okay? So take a look at this. This one is called Carlton Lodge. Okay, Carlton Lodge. It's, there's no difference between a lodge and a hotel. I don't know. Maybe a lodge is just a little bit of an older looking building. You can see it's sort of, I don't know, it has, it has more wood. <laughs> That's the only thing I can think of. But yeah, here are like stores, Lululemon. Um, it's over here. Just, yeah, just a lot of little stores and Hey, look at this. Now, I already took you up the mountain in my video, right? But I'll just show you here where the, uh, where the gondola leaves from. So you can kind of see this area. But yeah, I mean, what else can I show you? Uh, you know, places like this are usually the same in Canada. Um, like parks, like especially like ski resorts and things like that. There will be a little village, right? Banff. In Alberta, Banff National Park is the same thing, or, or Lake Louise, or Fernie, or any, any of the other places. They've got sort of a little village with some shops, some restaurants, um, 
yeah, it's, it's sort of a nice feeling, but like I said, it's just really, really busy. And, uh, and the prices are a bit higher in a place like this. I mean, right now it is June 5th. I think today is June 4th or 5th. And uh, so it's not peak season. You know, if you come here in the winter in uh, like really good skiing weather or snowboarding, you know, it'll be really expensive. Like I told you yesterday, I'm paying uh, just under $100 a night for my hotel. If you came in peak season, I bet it would be a few hundred dollars a night to stay here. So you can go up there, you know, all the way to the top of the mountain. There, wow. Yeah, I don't really know, don't know if there's anything much else to show you here. Um, what else would you like to know about Whistler Village? Let me know down there in the comments and I'll, I'll try to answer your questions. But uh, I think that's it for me. That's all I have to say. Just gonna walk back here and give you some more sights of Whistler Village.